but as one or two board members to you know represent the interests at uh, all she, what is it to, to the perspectives of the organized private sector yes in, you know the trade sector particularly the import export trade process is one of the biggest challenges okay. that businesses are facing okay i know the president has been very very particular about issues of investment climate you exactly, know, exactly. Uh, he has said that to domestic investors. He has also stated that to foreign investors. Uh, that as much as possible, all the hurdles impeding the performance of business mm -hmm. will be removed. Okay. Yes, he has. And he that said it yet. repeatedly that the okay. book stops on, on his desk here. Yeah. So this is a very, very critical thing. Uh, because if we are talking about ease of doing business, I think one of the areas to especially focus on is the area that has to do with our ports, with our import, export, trade processes, the entire ecosystem. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There's a whole lot to be Indeed. done. And the, the current CG is somebody who is also very committed to these reforms. He's as committed as the president to these reforms. So I think that is the whole idea. And because the private sector also it will bear a lot of the brunt of some of the inadequacies in that system. Okay. Uh -huh. It was felt that and, and it takes, the, the, you know, the, the, the private sector should also be represented. And the private sector has always been anyway represented. Okay. So I think it's a question of just sustaining that, uh, that, that representation. That, yeah, that's representation. And, uh, interest. Yeah. Well.